congratulations. Thank Can you, you just, uh, for the interview, your, your name and where you're from and what the award is? Uh, yes, my name is Terry Dulham. I'm uh, formerly from uh, WDAZ-TV, an ABC affiliate in Grand Forks, North Dakota. This is the um, Silver Circle Award. I'm uh, one of three inductees this evening and uh, very honored and humbled to be one of them. Congratulations. Thank you. So this is for uh, a career, an entire career of work. Uh, as I understand it, it's a, uh, yes, for uh, 25 years or more of service uh, to, uh, to television. And, and so, uh, yeah, here we are. And it, it's always been in the upper Midwest for you? and I spent 39 years at WDAZ and a couple of other years in uh, another North Dakota station. And uh, so, yeah, my, virtually my entire career was in North Dakota. So I retired uh, uh, about a year ago. What would be a fond memory that you'd like to share? Well, there's so many, you know, it's, it's, it's about the people. I'm, I'm sure you've heard that many times tonight, but it's, it's about the people you work with and, and, and the friendships you make. Um, there, there's something uh, bonding about the news business, and uh, it's just the people. Uh, how did you first get started in broadcasting? Um, I always wanted to do this or something like this. I always thought that I would be a... Um, maybe in radio and maybe programming a radio station and then I got a television news job and um, kind of out of the blue and, and kind of uh, I thought well I'll try this for a little while <laughs> so I did <laughs> 39 years later <laughs> yeah I guess so but uh, yeah it's it's uh, there's nothing like it and I'm sure you've heard that as well tonight any funny stories of things happening along the way uh, Oh, so many. Uh, <laughs> you, you put me on the spot. Yeah. Uh, but uh, yeah, lots of lots of uh, lots of funny stories. A lot of um, uh, sort of um, stories that that aren't so funny. The the thing that I'll always remember in my career is covering the uh, 1997 flood when we had uh, virtually the entire uh, city uh, cities of Grand Forks and East Grand Forks were evacuated, and we uh, stayed on the air. Uh, 24-7 for a couple, three weeks. Many of us camped out at the station, and, uh, you know, I think we helped the community through that time. I think if they saw that we were still there, they would have something to come back to, and, uh, and they did. So uh, that's, that's my memory. Uh, yeah. That's fantastic. Thank you, and congratulations Thanks again. Thanks very much. Thank, Thank you. you.